how do you paint a picture without having any visuals? That's kind of what we have to do a lot when we do radios. For example, in this specific radio, which sounded like this. Hello, this is your captain speaking, and I'd like to welcome you to Sunny Baja. Excuse me, where's the ceviche? Oh, right over there. It's made fresh daily. We had to make it sound like it was an employee at a grocery store acting like an airline pilot on the speakers in the grocery store. So there was a lot of stuff going on that you couldn't really see, but we had to play around with to make it make sense, right? We did a combination of a bunch of stuff. Um, for example, this one, this track is literally just um, the speaker that we shifted to the, you can see over here, we shifted it to the right side. Hello, this is your captain speaking. Hello, this is your captain speaking. But we had to make it make sense um, that he was in front of you. We did that with speakerphone, but we also did really harsh EQing to make it sound like it's coming from like a phone. You know, like how like, when you're on the phone, you can't really hear a lot of the frequencies. Without those two things, it would sound like this. Your captain speaking, and I'd like to welcome you which makes it feel like he's just in, fr in front of you. That's why we had to do all of these little steps to make it feel like he's coming out of the speakers. Um, some other really fun things that we like to do sometimes is when there's dialogue, we kind of, we can shift or we can pan something to the, to the left a little bit, like this guy. Um, so it feels like everybody's coming from different places. So, You're too sunny, Baja. Excuse me, where's in the ceviche? Oh, right over there. It's made fresh daily. So it kind of gives you the sense of space. Um, also, the sound design um, that we added. But yeah, with those little tricks, really help you feel like you're in the space without actually seeing anything. Right, cool. cool. He has a 